get on baby now Come on twist and shout Come on, come on, come on, come on baby now You've got to work it on out We'll work it on out honey You know you look so good You know you got me going now Just like I knew you would Hi guys, uh, Tony here with a brand new lesson on Twist and Shout by the Beatles. I'll take you through the chords, the strumming and everything else. So let's zoom in. I'll pick up my guitar and we'll break this song down. Oh, so yeah. the three chords we'll use in this song will be a D, a G and an A. Okay, so for the D we'll put our first finger, three strings up on the second fret, our middle finger on the bottom string, second fret, and our third finger on the B string, third fret. Okay, and we play this from the D string. <clears throat> okay, so then we're going to put our pinky on the bottom string, and we're going to take these fingers up, our first finger to the, the A string, second fret, our middle finger to the top string, third fret, and that's a G. Okay, and then we have an A, which is on the second fret, the D, G, and B string, and we play that from the A string. Okay, now I tend to play an A like this. Okay, it's completely optional. Uh, we bar the three strings using your one finger. And it's easier to go from here to here rather than here to here. Well, for me, it just feels more natural to do it this way. Okay, so we've got our three chords. D, G, and A. So, an easy way of strumming this would just be by doing this. Two. D, D, G, G, A. A and A and A and D. Okay, the strum that I'm using, it may be, it's quite fast, it may be a little bit difficult if you're, if you're just starting. But Okay, so you could re really play the whole song like that, just using those three chords. And then when it comes to the um, the bridge part, you can mix it up a little bit. You don't need to do this, uh, but you can mix it up by using some bar chords and this little bass run. So what I'm doing there, you've got five, seven on the low E, four, and then you're going into this D chord here, which is you've got your bar in the, the fifth fret from the, the A string, and you're using this A shape here on the seventh fret, so you're barring the, uh, the D, G, and B string. And then you're using the E bar chord here on the third fret for a G. And then 
then bar on the fifth fret to play the A here. Okay. Okay. So I'd play um, that four times. Okay. So. Again, you don't need to do this if you can't play bar chords, you can just... It's the same chords, okay. Right, and then for the... Uh, 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 <laughs> I'm going to go into an E chord. So I'm doing here, I'm um, in an E, and I'm going down, up, down. Down, 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 down. So. Shake it on, baby. Twist and shout. And that's... That's it. That's the whole song. So I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you soon with more cool songs to play.